What's up everyone? I hope you're doing really great. I'm doing great because I'm in Gdansk, Poland this weekend for the event Dance Hall Meetup. It's my second time in Gdansk and my third time in Poland if I'm not mistaken. The event is two days, Saturday and Sunday, but I will only participate in Sunday for the one versus one male and of course dance hall. Today they also have contests and um, workshops, but I will only participate tomorrow. But because I'm super close to the venue, I will definitely check out what is happening today as well. I left this morning i think i left home around 7 15 7 20 to get to brussels airport that went pretty smooth um i went with a car because there were no trains that would get me there on time so thumbs up for public transport yay um so yeah but luckily i got a ride to the airport the plane had super delay with leaving i don't remember or recall exactly what the reason was but we arrived with a delay in frankfurt where i had my layover to gdansk and really i had to run to to get it i think we got off the plane like 15 minutes before my plane left or 20 minutes before my second plane left and then we had to still get into a bus and then the bus had to go to the terminal and then from the terminal we had to go to our respective gates or go home if you didn't have a connecting flight or to wherever you're going if you don't have a connecting uh, flight. Luckily for me, where the terminal or where the bus dropped us off at the terminal was pretty close to the gate that I had to take and I think it only took me like two minutes, three minutes, but I really ran to the gate <laughs> to be there on, on time. I think I probably was the last one boarding um, of course, yeah, because the plane had to leave on time, or at least they tried, because again, for this plane, there was a delay. Of course, there was less implications from my side, because I'm only participating tomorrow, so even if I arrived 30 minutes or 40 minutes later than expected, I still would have made it for the event or the, the, the contest competition tomorrow. So, but now I'm here at the hotel all as well. It was a, a pretty eventful travel to get here. It's been a while since I had to run for a flight. I think it only happened two, three times. Definitely one with a connecting flight. But yeah, like I said, all as well, I made it here on time for the event. So let me give you a tour of my uh, hotel room that I'm in right now here in Poland. I'm super close to the venue. Like the venue or the school, the dance school where the event is taking place is within a mall. And this hotel is actually at the mall as well. So I'm super close. I can walk there in, in 1 minute 30 seconds probably. So that's super convenient for me. So what we have here is the, the place to put your coats or your clothes or whatever. I already um, put my sweater here. You can also... Put them here obviously you have the mirror hey what's up um tv if you want to watch that as well a bed or specifically two beds to sleep in because i actually think they're two separate ones yeah they're two separate ones but doesn't really matter for me i will just pick one side and stick to it so yeah let's go we have our towels yeah also my stuff already laying around here um what else do we have we have a desk which is also are always convenient to have. We got some stuff here to boil water, to make tea, super nice. Also provided some tea. I think actually this one will be sugar probably, or is it instant coffee, sugar, and whatnot, creamer. Yeah, so you can make tea. And if you have instant coffee, you can also make it yourself. 
water we have a fridge which is good if i want to buy something that is yeah it needs to be cold you know needs to stay cold already dumped my stuff from my bag in here you can see some view let's see what we have and we have a construction site and there's another one well luckily for me i didn't come for the the view but okay i mean it is what it is it doesn't matter too much won't be looking through the window that often in any case and now i have to get out of this thing here curtains okay so my bag then we have here like a super small area to sit like with a chair and a table so that's also cool actually it's a pretty spacious room if you look at it like that like the, the space that you have between your bed and everything and gives it a super spacious feeling well it's also just super spacious um considering the square meters that you have here a picture i assume it's from gdansk if it's not then upper wouldn't can couldn't tell you either if it was or not then the bathroom which is hi it's me um which is okay usually we have our sink we have our shower we have our nice echo in the bathroom heater stuff toilet usual thing again it's pretty spacious like i had hotel rooms where the bathroom was probably basically this but now it's kind of double or uh more so on my way to the event now before i went to the shop got something to eat but now i'm going to the event and seeing what's going on there right now Back at the hotel from the first day at the event slowly winding down i eat drink something and yeah getting ready to go to bed already took out my contacts have my glasses on all freshen up in a bit and then yeah getting to bed so i'm fresh and ready to go tomorrow Good morning, it's 7.30, 7.40, just woke up and uh, yeah, time for food, first thing, food. In some morning tea, wow, my voice. <clears throat> Getting myself dressed for the battle quickly threw on a sweater, which is not sitting nicely at the moment. But anyway, so yeah, I'm dressed, ready to go, have my bag packed. So I'm all set to leave to the venue now. Let's go.
so it's now Monday morning. I'm ready or almost ready. Well, I still have an hour left to check out and then head to the airport. So a summary of what happened yesterday at the battle. So there were around 25 to 30 people in the pre-selection of my category, the one versus one male. Eventually, the top eight got selected to go to the seven to smoke. I was one of the people in the top eight and the seven to smoke. What we had to do was collect um, seven points to win or the person with the most points uh, would win if the time expired. Eventually, when the time expired, there were four people with four points. I was one of them. And then we had to get one extra round or we had one final with four people where we had to dance. So it was in a clash forum, the final. So every dancer was going eight counts and we would just take turns dancing. Eight counts for one and a half minutes, two minutes. Yeah, and that was the finals. And then based on that, the three judges made their decision. Unfortunately, I didn't take the win home. But I had a nice conversation with the different judges to see what I can work on to improve and to yeah take to my training and then hopefully do a better job at the next battle and maybe specifically at the next edition of this event. Packed and ready to leave. Whatever you do, don't forget to stay hydrated. And like that, another event, another trip comes to an end. Please let me know in the comments what your favorite city is in Poland, if you've been there before, if you haven't been there before and would like to visit Poland in the future, where would you go first? As always, don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe and click that notification bell so you get a notification when a new video is uploaded. I wish you all a great day and I will see you in the next one. Go out.